When Henry Cavill was very young, he went to a boarding school and things were not easy for him. He was bullied by the other kids for being overweight. He was an easy target and was called Fat Cavill. He didn't fit in very well, he didn't have many friends, he didn't spoke a lot and was very emotional. Henry missed his family very much, so he felt insecure, unhappy and alone. So to comfort himself he ate. They also called him Lemon, a guy who gets nowhere with the girls. To fight his loneliness, Henry began acting in school plays. But on top of everything, he also suffered from a disease which causes swelling in the knee joints, so Cavill couldn't exercise. But fortunately, that condition passed with time. In 2001, Henry landed a movie role and started taking care of his body more and lost a lot of weight. But he knew that getting in shape and actually staying there is a long and unpleasant process that requires commitment and not giving up so easily. And Henry was tired of feeling miserable, so he was ready to start changing his life. But becoming a successful Hollywood actor was a long and painful process filled with many rejections, failures and obstacles. Henry Cavill auditioned for the role of James Bond, but lost the role because of his weight. He was called chubby by the film director. But he wasn't offended by this rejection, because he was aware that he had to try harder to learn how to train and eat better, so he was actually grateful for that. In 2006, he unsuccessfully auditioned for the role of Superman in Superman Returns, but lost the role to another actor. He also tried out for a role in Harry Potter, but was rejected. He tried to get the main role in the movie Twilight, but again, rejected. They told him he looked too old to play the part, and after losing so many important roles, he was named the unluckiest man in Hollywood. And these are just some of the many roles he lost. But failure didn't stop him. He used the rejections to learn something new and improve each time. I wasn't ecstatic about not getting these things, but I was so used to disappointment from the acting business and also from boarding school. No, you're not good enough. That wasn't anything new to me. Henry said that he found motivation in the roles he almost got, realizing that coming so close to getting roles like Superman and James Bond meant that he should keep trying and not give up on his dream. Henry Cavill had some notable roles throughout the years, but he really hit it big when he got to play Superman in Man of Steel. That movie was a massive worldwide success and became the highest grossing Superman movie of all time, making Henry Cavill globally famous. So the kid who was once picked on and called Lemon and Fat Cavill became Superman. And the unluckiest man in Hollywood is not so unlucky anymore. He won everyone's hearts playing Geralt of Rivia in the new drama series The Witcher. His success didn't happen overnight. He didn't wake up one day with a toned body and successful career. He actually worked hard for it. And you can become anything you want if you're disciplined. You need to make a commitment. Think of three habits that you'll commit to this year that will change your life for the better. And please focus on them. Aren't you tired of feeling miserable and unhappy? It's time to make a promise to yourself. It's time to make yourself a priority. It's time to go and get everything they told you you couldn't have. It's time. So whatever you want to be in this life, work hard for it. It won't be easy. It will take a lot of pain, sweat and tears, but it will be worth it. So, what's your story?